given under my hand at Pretoria on this day, 2024. So I signed away the <laughs> Government first mooted the national health insurance back in 2011, but it's now become an act of law. Its intention? To provide universal health care to all South Africans. So how will this be realised? The first step will be to create the NHI fund, which will operate like a business, to buy services for all South Africans from both the public and private sector. This fund could take at least a year to establish. So where will the money come from? The NHI Act proposes increased tax collection to be determined by National Treasury. This could be in the form of a payroll tax, much like the UIF, and an increase in personal taxes. Who is eligible for the NHI? The idea is for all South Africans, permanent residents, refugees and some categories of foreign nationals to receive treatment at a facility closest to where they live, whether this is a public or private institution, if they have a contract with the NHI the NHI will pay the supplier directly for the service you receive. So what will happen to private medical aid schemes? Once the NHI covers a benefit, medical aid schemes may not cover the same service. In time, it will mean the benefits they cover will be dramatically reduced, their membership will dwindle, and they may not be able to survive to only offer additional benefits not covered by the NHI. Does this mean you will still be able to visit a private doctor? Yes, you will but you will have to pay for their services in cash and you won't be able to use your medical aid scheme to pay for a service already provided by the NHI. Why are some sectors arguing the NHI is unconstitutional? Many believe while the concept is noble, the NHI model in its current form is unaffordable and will limit your choice of the health care you receive. The private sector argues it will stifle competition by blocking it from offering services also offered by the NHI while the medical fraternity says it's forcing doctors to work for the state. How long will the rollout take? Health Minister Joe Pachler estimates the first phases of the NHI will take at least four years, with the full implementation expected by 2030.